Hi, I'm Mark Atkowski, and today we're going to go through 2192 North Junipero. We're on the north end of Palm Springs, and this is a two-bedroom, two-bath condo unit that lives like a house. Great courtyard. Let's go take a look. The first thing you'll encounter about this home is the fact that it's got a spectacular outside living area. So if you've been looking for something where you get to enjoy the outside as well as the inside, and it's pretty much lock it and leave it in the sense that you're part of a compound, this works out very nicely. From the outside fireplace, you can enjoy a calm evening outside to the koi, koi pond that gurgles to a great outside area just to enjoy entertaining. Very, very cool. So the entrance for this particular home is unique. It's actually off of the alley side of the home. As I said, this is a condo in technicality. When they created this home, what they did is they, they made a duplex. This unit, this two bedroom unit, has an identical unit on the opposite side that faces the street. So this particular unit has a really large courtyard and the way that it's oriented protects it from the sunshine. So it's, it's very nicely done. It just has a, a different type of approach whenever you're coming to this particular home. Now what I did was I was showing you the front yard and now looking at the living room, um, there are two doorways here. Both these doorways go to specific bedrooms. The, uh, the one on the left by the fireplace goes to the master bedroom that has a walk-in closet. The second door there that you see goes to the second bedroom and it, it has a courtyard that's to the south. And as I come all the way around, you're gonna see a doorway that is a powder room that's just beyond the sculpture here. A very nicely sized pantry with lots of shelving and then a really terrific kitchen area. All right, I'll go to a different angle so you can kind of explore this space a little bit more. I know it seems like I just stepped outside again, but what I'm doing is I wanted to show how you can blend the interior and exterior spaces. So I'm looking south over towards the outdoor fireplace, and as I come around, we're gonna go past the cornering fireplace, which has uh, glass in it, which is really nice, and uh, master suite, which we're not gonna check out just yet, and then we're gonna pan around the rest of this space. Um, one of the nice things about the living room is it's got the Claire Story windows. In the last view, you would have seen those cornering. Just looking up so you can see the way that this is a tall space. It's got a lot of room. You can see the kitchen that's in the distance there, dining room in between. The doorway that you see there is a laundry space storage area, and it goes over to the two-car garage. As I come all the way around, you see the entry area where the front door is located. There's really nothing like having a beautiful kitchen. And in this particular home, it's great. I mean, the glass, the orange glass tile that's on the backsplash, the beautiful granite slab countertops, really, really spectacular. You've got the casual dine-in area here with the, uh, with the chairs that go along this particular bar. And then as I go around, you can see the travertine tile that goes throughout. And you see where the dining room is located in the central area so you know it's it's compact it's easy it's very nice for entertaining it's just a really beautiful space and just off of the kitchen dining area you're going to have uh, a nicely ac uh, accommodated counter So off of the living room and the exit that goes out to the yard and the front entry, I've stepped into the master suite. So as I come around here, what you're gonna see is the first of the two bedrooms. This bedroom is nice because it opens up directly to the outside. So again, fire pit area there, you can hear the gurgling of the, um, the koi pond that's outside. It's just, it's a really nice space. It's got terrific light. This is east facing, northeast facing. Um, and so it's just, it's extremely pleasant. I've stepped over now to the other corner of the master so I can give you a view looking this direction. What you're gonna see is there's a, a barn door slider there for the door that goes to the master bathroom. The second door goes to the walk-in closet. And then of course you have the door that goes back to the living room. I'm looking now into one of the two or three bathrooms, I should say. This is the master suite. It's, um, it's got the same granite that's in the kitchen, which is nicely done, and beautiful cabinets. Just a, it's a very simple, it's very elegant. It is a very nice bath. 
to anchor you with where we are, I'm just looking back at the kitchen and I'm coming around to take a look at the second bedroom. This is used as an office and you can see they have it all set up here with shelving. The bathroom is in the uh, distance there and then it's very similar to the master bath. Uh, as I come around, you can see that there's a nice full-size window. This goes out to the courtyard side um, for this particular room and home. And um, there's a, a nice sliding double closet. So there's plenty of storage space in here as well. And then as I come all the way around, you're again going to see out toward the living room. I'm going to show you the bathroom. I'm just going to go in from the shelving that we have here in the second bedroom and just take a nice quick look here at the finish. Uh, really, just both bathrooms in this particular home are done exceptionally well, uh, really pleasant, and uh, the travertine tile is a lovely touch, the hardware, the glass enclosure, and of course both of them have a very nice uh, kind of window up top so you have air but privacy. I've just stepped outside the door here at the second bedroom and uh, you're going to see me in the reflection. Hey, it's Mark Gutkowski with markgps.com and here's the mountain view. So that's your west facing view which is going to be that direction. When you're in the fire pit, when you're by the fire pit in the evening, uh, you can see the, the, um, the sun go down there. It's very pleasant. I'm going to do a quick view of the laundry room and I'm starting at the front door so you get an idea of where we're at. The laundry room is a pass through. It goes to the garage. There's a two-car garage on this particular home. Uh, there is a lot of storage in here, which is nice. Uh, you can see the alarm pad, of course. And then a uh, continuation of that slab granite that's through here. Everything is just beautifully done. I'm going to leave you with a final view here of the entrance to the house. Uh, I, I forgot to mention, but the courtyard can have a pool in it. Uh, you can put a spool in there unit that's on the back side, which is completely independent. Uh, they have their own pool and they take care of their entire side of the house themselves. This is the two-car garage from the front. There are two separate doors and both of those are for this unit. Again, everything is separate. All right, it's Mark Gutkowski. Please feel free to check out the 3D tour of this online. And if you have any questions about real estate in Palm Springs, of course, check me out online again. MarkGPS.com.